Hello there, fourth dimension by trading time. Sean here. Uh, this is the update on foreign exchange. So big things happening this week. Lots of central bank stuff. Massive payroll number. Uh, but we actually got the buy signal on the dollar index on Thursday. So uh, said that the downtrend was over. Get out of the shorts. Um, to turn the trend up, needs a daily close above 103.48. Turn the trend down. Uh, got to take out Thursday's low. On to the euro. Also got a negative on Thursday, although it wasn't at uh, resistance. Um, daily close by, below 107.67 would turn the trend down. Pretty poor on cable as well. Um, got a range relativity negative on uh, Friday, and we closed below that 120.89 level, which is now the key resistance. Uh, trend is down, and target's 114.96. Got a yen, uh, opposite signal. Important that weekly resistance move to support at 127.22 and a half. Um, close pretty much at that daily level, um, but uh, risks definitely on the upside because there is uh, no immediate resistance if we take out that uh, daily level. Euro yen. Um, stuck in the sideways, uh, not a great deal going on there. Dollar Swiss also uh, had a signal, um, double signal on Friday. Daily close above 92.91 turns the trend up, and of course, big support 91.81. Aussie, Aussie reached its major upside target at 71.38 on Wednesday. And then again, uh, negative Thursday and a big negative on Friday. So targets 68.28. Kiwi, also a major negative on Friday. Daily close below, let's just get it right. 63.16 turns the major trend down and leaves support a long, long way away. Key resistance, 64.70. Dollar CAD. Um, pretty quiet actually. Got to take out 34.73 above to turn the trend up. And finally, Euro Pound. Um, new highs for the trend, nothing above until 92.69. Okay, thank you.